What are the sunnahs of prayer? Eleven sunnah while standing one, during takbir tarima. Stand up straight, that is do not lower your head. Two, keeping the toes facing the qibla. Of course, it is mustahab to keep space between the two feet. Three, tarima in muqtadi's takbir is immediately followed by tarima in imam's takbir. Four, for men, raising both hands up to the ears while saying tarima in takbir. Five, keeping both palms facing qibla during takbir tarima. Six, keep fingers in normal position. Seven, the fingers of the right hand are placed on the back of the left hand during the handshake. Eight, make a circle with the thumb and little fingers of the right hand and encircle the joint of the left hand. 9. Place three fingers in the middle on the arm. 10. Hands below the navel. 11. Chick reading seven sunnahs of Kirat 1. Auzu billah full reading. 2. Reading Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. 3. Say Amin at the end of Surah Fateh. 4. Recitation of one of the surahs from Surah Hudrat to Surah Baruj in the recitation of Fajr and Zor prayers, and reciting any one of the surahs from Surah Tariq to Surah Lam Yakun in Asr and Isha prayers, and reciting any surah from Surah Ziljal to Surah Naz in Maghrib prayer. 5. Reciting Surah Fateha only in the third and fourth rakats of obligatory prayers. 6. Reciting the Kirat at a moderate pace. 7. Making the Quran of the first rakat of Fajr prayer longer than the second rakat. Ruku Sunat 8.1, saying Allahu Akbar while bowing. 2. For men, holding the knees firmly with both hands while bowing. 3. Fingers spread between knees for men. 4. Laying the back flat. 5. Keeping the ankles straight during Ruku. 6. Keeping head and butt equal. 7. Saying Subhanallahi Rabi al Azim at least three times in Ruku. 8. While getting up from Ruku, the Imam should say loudly for the Imam, Samiyala Huliman Hamida and the muqtadi should say softly, Rabbana lak alhamdu. And for the one who prays alone, saying both sentences. There are twelve sunnahs of prostration one, saying Allahu Akbar while going for sajda. Two, when going to sijda, first place the knees on the ground. Three, then keep both hands. Four, then hold your nose. Five, then keep the forehead. Six, prostrate between the two hands. Seven, keeping the stomach separate from the run and the forearms from the arms during sajda. Eight, keeping the tendon separate from the tissue. 9. Saying Subhana Rabi al-Allah at least three times during sajda. 10. Saying Allahu Akbar while rising from sijda. 11. When rising from sijda, first raise the forehead, then the nose, then both hands, then both knees. 12. Sitting slowly between two prostrations. There are 13 sunnahs of sitting for Atahiyatu 1. Keeping the right foot upright and sitting on the left foot spread and the toes facing the Qibla. 2. Keep both hands on the run. 3. Raising shahadat fingers while saying Ashhadu Allah ilaha in atahiyat and lowering them while saying La ilaha. 4. Recitation of Durud Sharif after atahiyat in the last meeting. 5. After Durud Sharif, read Dua Matura with words similar to Quran and Hadith. 6. Returning greetings to both sides. 7. Starting salutation from the right side. 8. Destining the righteous angels and righteous jinn behind the veil. 9. For Muqtadi. To intend the imams, the angels, and the virtuous jinn and other muqtadi of Dunbam. 10. Muqtadis returns salam immediately after the imam. 11. Making the sound of the second salam smaller than that of the first salam. 12. Ignoring being an imam fareg for the mass book. That is, the mass book will stand up after the imam is separated from the second salam and not before. Special benefit. Fingers were spread in ruku, but in sajda they will be united, and in other conditions it will be normal. The next sunnahs before the five daily prayers are two rakahs before the Fajr prayer, four rakahs before Zor, and two rakahs after it, four rakahs before ASR, two rakahs after Maghrib, four rakahs before Salatul Isha, and two rakahs after it too. Salatut Doha. Every morning on all the pairs, 360 of a person, sadaka becomes payable, every tazbi is a sadaka, enjoining good deeds is a sadaka, and forbidding evil is a sadaka. All this becomes sufficient by reading two rakahs of Salat ad Doha. Its timing starts approximately 15 minutes after sunrise and lasts until 15 minutes before Zohar prayer. The best time is when it is fully heated. Its lowest rakah is two, and may Allah have mercy on the person who prays four rakahs before Salat al-Asr.